here we are with part two. So now we've got all the dirt. So we're ready to, what are we ready to do, Gigi? We're gonna put some plants in. And Mrs. Rowe really likes red, white, and blue. And so this is kind of red, white, and blue plant. And you know, she's a mommy too. So this was my gift to her for Mother's Day to plant her planter. Now here's a nice pot that you could hang, but what's really nice is you can use it. Now see, I'm tapping it because I gotta get the plants out. I turn it over and look at there. I can take that off. Look at the roots. See all those roots? That's how the plant goes. Now what I do, I kind of, you know, these roots have been growing for a while, so I have to squeeze them a little bit to get them loose. So when I put them in, and it makes a mess, and I will clean this up. All right, so we put this. Now my dirt's pretty wet, so I really don't have to give it a lot of water, but this isn't real wet. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put a little water. You'd love this, because it's like a mid bath. <laughs> and is it fun to play in the dirt? But look what Gigi has on, gloves. Because it's really important. Because sometimes, you know, the dirt, there's, you can have, you know, stuff in it that you do really don't want in your hands. All right, so look, I got a hole, and I needed a big hole. And I gotta be careful. You don't wanna be, you know, too rough on your plants. All right, so I'm just gonna put this right in the middle. All right, I'm gonna scoot it down. Ooh, it says thank you, it feels great. But you know what? The dirt's not tucked around. So remember at the side, I'm gonna move the dirt close because it's really important that it's got dirt all the way around. So I carefully lift up the flowers and I squeeze the dirt. Okay, see how I'm patting it? And we'll do this again over here. Because see, we just don't want to just plop it in. It's got to have a new house for the plants and roots. All right, so that's a start. But you know what? Mrs. Rowe really likes a lot of plants. So we need to put more in the pot. But look over here. I don't have enough dirt. So what I need to do is I need to take some more dirt and do it again. It's kind of just like step by step. And this is how you can do a pretty pot. All right. So on this side, I have some more dirt. Hmm. So I think I need something that's kind of tall. And these are a really pretty flower. Well, what are those called? Those are called austere, osteum, osterum, osterums, I think. But boy, that's a big word. But you know what? On each plant, you get a little paper, and it tells you about the plant. It says, all right, you need to have lots of sun. You need to give it water. So I have to follow directions. You know, reading is always one of the most important things. So I take that out. Look at my roots. Yeah, almost like curly hair. See, look at that. Isn't that amazing? This plant grows and it gets tall. Now I'm gonna put this in the back because the, the paper told me it gets tall. So I gotta make a hole. Okay, all right. All right, little plant, this is your new house. All right, I need a little bit more dirt so I can even use my hand. But see how I put that around? All right, doesn't that look pretty? It does. Oh, I think I will put another one there because you know, my mom used to tell me she was quite a planner too. You know, my mom lived till she was a hundred years old. She was 100 and a half. That's a pretty amazing life. Okay, see, so look at the roots here. Huh, I wonder, how could I get these out? Well, I can't cut them because I like those roots. So I squeeze them, look at there, and watch. Wow, isn't that pretty amazing? Mm -hmm. and look at those curly. All right, now remember, I gotta squeeze them a little. And remember, a hole. Here's a little new house for my plant. And look at there. But I don't have enough dirt. So see, it's step by step. I put some dirt in, I dig a hole. I find a plant, I put it in, and I pat it down. Now, if this dirt wasn't wet, I'd have to give it a drink. But right now, these plants are pretty wet, so I don't have to. So what do you think? Don't you think it looks beautiful? It's beautiful. Now, I have a mess, so when you're finished planting, you always have to clean up your mess. So look at my mess here. I'm gonna have to pick up things. I'm gonna have to get a broom. I'm gonna have to sweep the step. 
but that's part of being a helper in the community. Bye!